Hello and welcome to Concepts Over Calculations, Mechanics. My name is Dr. Jacob Hudis. The question I'm posing to you today is about tension in a string and the reading on the spring scale in configuration A and configuration B. So let's get started. We'll begin with configuration A. Two 50 Newton masses are suspended motionless over frictionless pulleys as shown in the diagram. This is a 50 Newton mass connected by a string to another 50 Newton mass and there's a spring scale in the center. The question is, what is the reading on the spring scale in this setup? Does the spring scale read 50 newtons, 100 newtons, or another value? Do you know the answer? I'll go over the answer on the next slide. Me and Albert Einstein have something in common. Both of us took a picture with our tongues out. Let's start by looking at the free body diagram of this mass. This mass is not moving. The force of gravity downward is 50 newtons and the tension force upward is 50 newtons. If the tension force upward were anything other than 50 newtons, the mass would not be in equilibrium and it would be accelerating. Now let's look at a small piece of the string. This piece of the string is also not moving because the entire problem is in equilibrium. The tension is 50 newtons pulling in all directions. The answer to the question is that the spring scale reads 50 newtons. Tension is the same everywhere throughout a rope. That's an important concept in mechanics. And so if the tension is 50 newtons here, and we're assuming this is a massless, frictionless pulley, then the tension is 50 newtons everywhere, and the spring scale has to read 50 newtons. If the, if the spring scale read 100 newtons, it would be a non-equilibrium situation because the tension at this location is 50 newtons and the tension at this location is 50 newtons. So if this all of a sudden had a force of 100 newtons, things would start moving. Tension in a string pulls with the same magnitude in all directions. And now for configuration B. There's the same 50 newton mass. It's attached to a rope with tension in it. There's a spring scale, and then the rope is attached to a wall. And of course, this is in equilibrium. What is the reading on the spring scale in this configuration? Because the tension is still 50 newtons, the answer is the spring scale still reads 50 newtons. The magnitude of tension in a rope is the same always. It changes direction, but the magnitude is always the same. If the spring scale read 100 newtons, this would be a non-equilibrium situation. I'm Dr. Jacob Hudis. Thanks for joining me on this episode of Concepts Over Calculation.